The Cat Spa is a 1954 Pepe Le Pew cartoon directed by Chuck Jones, written by Michael Maltese, with voices provided by B. Badadere and Mel Blanc. And this one's a little bit different because Pepe Le Pew is talking to the camera and he is about to tell the story of the time he chased Penelope uh, through the Casper, which gives us a, a different location and, and a slightly different setting. And I thought, okay, this is going to be different. It's going to be quite interesting. Let's see what they do with this. And honestly, I just felt like the narrative wasn't that interesting. What unfolded wasn't fascinating at all. And the only thing that really worked was the change of setting that meant it was slightly different to look at, slightly different colour palette. We used to get a lot of like pale you know, whites and pinks and things in, in Pepe Le Pew, whereas we have slightly bolder colours here and more earthy colours. So visually it's a little bit different, but in terms of the narrative, it's not that interesting. And I honestly didn't care about it. And, you know, Penelope as a character I don't mind. I believe this was the first time she was named as Penelope, but I could be wrong about that. But from start to finish, I just thought it's relying too heavily on the change of location and on the story within a story. Not that I want to say it's gimmicky, that's not quite what's going on here, but I feel like it was a case of, well, we have these things that are different, so we don't need to try too much with the actual narrative or try too hard to make it interesting. Of course, I don't think they didn't try hard, but I just feel like it was relying too heavily, too much on the bits that make this different to the average Pepe Le Pew cartoon. So personally, I didn't love it. I might visit it again at some point just to see if my opinion changes. But honestly, for now, the Cat Spa is not one that entertained me.